What is up, Kartra fam? Welcome back to what is the beginning of a series, a Kartra tutorial, um, really tearing it apart, the nuts and, 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 and bolts, just the golden nuggets behind this entire platform, but keeping it simple, right? This is going to be the beginning of a series that I'll be emailing you guys and, and really trying to answer a lot of questions that I get a lot you know, quite frequently on, on, on different functions of the software. And then just overall basics that I, that I do daily, right. That I truly believe are, are more basic than, than, than what most probably think. Um, so I want to kind of just walk you through. And, and as I go through day in the life, I'll just start recording these videos and, and, and taking you through my journey on, on how to do it and how you can implement these basic, basic strategies to your business. Okay. And it applies for any business. I, I, you know, I, t I put a lot of videos out on YouTube, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, definitely subscribe. I'll put the but the the button below. But um, um, a lot of those videos are either day in the life tutorials that are that are breaking down either Facebook ads or 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 even you know Kartra. Um, but these videos that you're going to be getting most likely won't be on my YouTube channel. So this today's video you won't find on on my YouTube channel at all. Um, this will be a series of videos that I send your way just to kind of break down what I what I do and how I how I really leverage this cartridge system. Okay, so today I'm actually thinking of one of my clients, Anastasia. Shout out to Anastasia um, with Best Washington Properties, crushing it in Washington um, with EXP Realty and. and with, with EXP Realty and really doing her thing, right? Really, really doing it. Um, and so I'm, I'm thinking of her in, in, in really in my day, day, daily work today because I'm gonna actually be sending out my YouTube video. Her and I, we've been working on our YouTube channels together and I'm really coaching her on, on that part. And so this is one thing that I do right away. So when a YouTube video, um, when, I, when I release a YouTube video, I'll come in here either the same day or the next day. Today happens to be the next day. The video that I'm, that I'm gonna be showing you how, to, how, how I send via email automation is this one that was actually released yesterday. So depending on when you're watching this, right, it was, it was yesterday. Um, and so you can either do it, you can either do it, you know, day of, or, or, or in this case, the next day, but for sure within 24 hours, that's what you want to be doing on a YouTube video, which is what I'm going to walk you through today. And, and what I'm walking you through is simply how to get in this, this, the reason why I want to share with all of you guys is because this applies for a link to a calendar, to a link to a product, to purchase, to a link to um, a video, to a link to a page, a, a link to a YouTube video in, in, in today's example, today's video that I'm going to be walking you through. Um, so this applies to anything, however you want to paint it. You know, this is a, a, a an email and, and it, can apply, it can apply to anything that, you're, that you guys are doing. So in this case, again, it's going to be a broadcast to people who are already on list. They're already already on a list or they're already in a sequence it doesn't matter but in this case i'm going to be going broadcasts based on people who are subscribed to a list okay um and so here's how i do it my whole objective today is to simply send out a broadcast email um to promote my youtube video that's what i'm doing right so what i what i tend to do um and, it, and again, depending on your business, but in my business, it's all about coaching. It's all about consulting. It's all about getting people to schedule an appointment with me, right? That's the number one objective is to get people to schedule an appointment with me um, to watch my video. Yes, for sure. Right. Um, but at the end of the day, I'm looking for appointments. I'm looking to help people um, when it comes to Facebook ads, when it comes to landing pages and this entire Kartra world, right? That's what my service consists of. So I'm in the, in the, in the business of appointments. So what I do is I simply go out there and create another page. So right here, um, first of all, I'm in my pages. And what you want to do is, is if you have a left and, and, and right mouse type of mouse, type of clickability, you know, I know some of you only have like one freaking button to click on, whether it's on your your keyboard or, or, or a mouse, but I have right click, right? I have right click. So what I do is I'll come to my pages, right? I'll come to my pages and then I'll go to my communications. I'll right click, open link in new tab and boom. Now over here in, in the next tab, I have my communications, right? Simple, right? Super simple. But the reason why I have these two open is because I, I need to work out of my pages real quick. What I do, again, because I'm in the business of appointments, what I do is I simply, again, really two objectives here, right? Objective number one is to get them to watch my YouTube video. That's really objective number one. But really what objective number, number one is, which is actually objective number two, in whatever order, whatever, 
But the second objective is to get them to schedule an appointment, right? Because that's the business we're in is, is getting appointments, right? So what I do is I is I'll create a broadcast. In my pages, you can create different categories, right? I have different categories, different pages within that category, right? And these are all different funnels within a category. So in my category of broadcast, I have two simple templates. One broadcast, this is a template, a page that I'll send to a certain list. This over here is a certain page that I'll, that I'll send to a certain list, right? So what I'll do, this page right here is this one right here. Let me refresh it. That's this one page. Okay, so again, I use, I use you know, Kartra for all of it. So all of you guys getting this specific tutorial today is, is, is hopefully still activated with Kartra. And if you're not, man, reactivate, shit, reactivate. And let me help you put this all together. But, but this is the single page. This is, this is a single page. And I'm gonna be dr driving the, the click in my email broadcast that I'm gonna show you how, and I'm gonna walk you through how I set that up. But I'm gonna be sending that click to this page. And, and just, to, just to go over why a page and not straight to YouTube, because that's a strategy as well. In my email, I can simply have them click a button. I can have them click and click a word. I hyperlink a word. I can have them click an image right in the email and I can send them straight to YouTube. That's one strategy. But the reason why I don't send them straight here is, is mainly for, for, for a few reasons, which, which is what I'll, which I'll simply just cover as I'm explaining why I send them to a page. The reason for it is because, and I got to edit this page real quick, which I'll show you how to do. But the reason for it is because as I send them to one page, reason number one is so I can Facebook pixel them. So right there, boom, I got a Facebook pixel and I don't just have one, your boy right here, you know, I, I practice what I preach. So I don't just have one pixel. I actually have two of my pixels, right? Tracking this page, tracking this link, tracking um, this visitor, right? So as they come here, that's, that's number one, I have them Facebook pixeled. Reason number two, I have them here and I have their attention. So for whatever time length this happens to last for, I have their attention a little longer had I send them straight to YouTube. And before you know it, they're on the right-hand column looking at other videos to click on, right? Before you know it, they're listening to freaking Wiz Kid and Justin Bieber, right? Before you know it, I sent them here and boom, before you know it, they're on a freaking completely different video. That doesn't happen here automatically. Yes, here as they come to the one page, they can click on the on the title and be on YouTube, right? They can click on the on the title and go straight to YouTube. They can click on on maybe even down here and go straight to YouTube and go straight to YouTube. They can click down here the logo and go straight to YouTube. Yes, for sure. But at least I have their attention a little longer, right? It's coming here. It's landing on one single page. There's the one video, um, and I have their attention a little a little longer had I sent them straight to YouTube. Okay, that's another reason. Third reason is so in that video, I can also have a call to action. I can also say, hey, guys, and by the way, if you'd like to schedule a call, click the button below. It'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your best time, right? So that's why whether it's an email sequence, okay, whether it's an email sequence or whether in this case it's an email broadcast, as I communicate with my leads, that's what the, the bottom line of this video. You got to be nurturing your lead. So as you dr drive traffic to your landing page or as you drive traffic anywhere, that lead should be captured. And so this is just the back end, whether, whether they're in a sequence or whether, they, or, or whether you're sending out a broadcast, which is, again, what I'm about to do right now, um, but I'm, I'm giving you context of how I'm thinking. Um, this is just how I'm going to do it. So, so that person going straight here and boom, there's the, the opportunity to schedule a call. That's what you guys should be doing if you're in the business of appointments. Okay. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to, I'm going to simply, I have two tabs open, right? I have my two tabs. I have my pages. I have my communications. I'm going to simply come over here to my pages and I'm going to come to the, to the one template that I want. And I'm going to simply clone it. This is going to be broadcast, but the title of this one is going to be pretty much the title of the video somewhat somewhat the same. So every local business owner should run this ad. Um, I'm going to go with that. Um, every local business owner. Yeah. So I'll just, I'll just put that for now. Every, every local business owner, and this is um, broadcast category and the site. Yeah. I'll leave it as, as that, that, that site. Um, this is just telling the system it's a page 
connected to that site, to that .com, right? The fivestepblueprint.com. So that's all that is, is a site. So you can start categorizing your sites as well. Um, but we'll get there. We'll get there. So here's the, the, the simple step one of my broadcast. I'm about to send out, set up the whole back end of the email. So this is the page. I clone it. And now all I'm going to do, everything with, with it comes, right? My Facebook pixel, everything about the page comes, even the page title. Look at the page title. In the tab, sell your listings fast on Facebook. That's the page title. But again, that's the page title for the old page. I just cloned it. So yes, it's going to duplicate and give me exactly that same page. But now all I'm going to do is come in here and do some basic editing. Okay. This becomes the page that I put in my email. And again, this could be an email in my sequence. It could be a broadcast email, either one. Today, it's going to be a broadcast. Um, and in fact, you know what? I'm actually putting this in the sequence of, of Kartra affiliates as well. So you guys are already getting this. This is actually, this video, this email is actually a part of a, of a, of a, of a, of a, of a video on a, on, a, on a page in an email sequence, which is, that's why you guys are getting it. So again, I'm just walking you through how I how I do it. This is this is crazy, right? This is crazy. So here's what I'm gonna do. And this I noticed this is actually not spaced. So let me space this real quick. This headline, and I don't even think that's the same text. Yeah, there's the text. That's the text that should have been showing. But to space it, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit the pencil, and then it's either the, actually it might be the T. It might be the T. It's actually the T. That's the margin there. I don't want the margin. I want. I do want the margin on the video though. So I'm going to hit the pencil and I'm going to space out this margin, give it a little bit, little bit space between the title and the video. And that's under style. So I'm going to move the margin a little to the right, which will lower the video. Bam. That's much better, right? So the video is a little lower than the title, but this title, I hit the T and I want to space out. So I think it's the line height. Um, let's try. Actually, no, it's actually, um, which one is it? It's actually. No, it's not the, the font, the two, I think it might be the two EM. Let's, let's check. There we go. There we go. So that's spaced it. That's spaced it a little, a little bit. Okay. So let's do a little bit. Two points. Yeah. That's spaced. Perfect. That's what it is. Okay. So let's go back to 2.2.3. 2 yeah. That, that, that looks better. Okay. Actually, maybe let's see if we can even go a little, little lower 2.3, 2.0. Let's highlight it. And then let's go 2.0. Yeah, that's that's fine. Perfect. Okay, good. Okay, so now here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to edit the title of the tab. That's SEO parameters. That's this page title. This shows up in the tab. So this is going to be... Um, um, run this local ad ASAP. Okay, run this local ad ASAP. Now that's gonna, as I, as I publish this page live, then um, up here in the tab, that's what will eventually show. Okay, so now here's what I'm gonna do. Here's what I'm gonna do. Now I'm gonna edit the video, right? Now I'm gonna edit the video. My whole thing is to drive them to the YouTube video, right? Um, so there's the link to the old YouTube video. I'm gonna grab the share link for the new YouTube video. And I'm gonna simply copy it, get out of there and simply come over here back to the URL, paste it in, apply. And I don't, you can autoplay if you want, but I don't, I don't autoplay. I just let them click play. That's fine. Um, but there's that, there's that, right? There's that, that's the new video. And then down here, I'll just put some type of, um, actually, you know what? I want to, I want to put that up. Yeah, I'll leave it there. I'll leave it there. And then I'd love to teach you how to run this simple Facebook I'd love to show you how to run these simple Facebook ads to your local area and capture more. Let's go, let's go buyer, capture more buyer and seller leads, leads than you can possibly handle. Click button below to schedule strategy call. Uh, actually, I'm going to go schedule strategy call. Schedule a strategy call today. Okay. Schedule your free schedule your free strategy call today. Okay. So and you know what? Let me I'm gonna actually take this out. I'm gonna cut backspace backspace 
and I'm going to go sections. Actually, it's components. I'm going to go text. I'm going to click and drag that text over. I'm going to paste in. I'm going to center this. And then I'm going to hover over it, hit the pencil. And I'm going to margin that to the left. Apply. Actually, dang it. Margin it. Um, there we go. OK, that's that's much better. OK, good. OK, schedule your free schedule your free strategy call today. Click here to schedule a call today. Click here to schedule. Click here to schedule. Schedule your free strategy call. Click here to schedule. OK, that's fine. I'm overthinking it. OK, so I'd love to teach you. Perfect. That's it. That's it. And that's the page. That's the single page. Boom. They click the button, it goes straight to my calendar, right? That's the whole purpose. So they're watching the video um, and, and, and you're clicking to schedule a call. Those are the reasons you send them, send them to a page. Okay, so I just added the image. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna edit the headline. Um, and, and this is going to, a, this is actually, no, this, this actually, yeah, this is going to um, um, an actual, real estate list okay of, of my clients that are real estate agents okay that's where this 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 broadcast is going to so this one's going to go um run this run this ad to your local area asap okay run this ad to your local area asap run this ad first okay Perfect. So settings, page title was changed, headline was changed, video was changed, any editing down here, simply basic editing uh, changed. And now all I'm going to do is I'm going to save progress. Remember, this is the clone, the cloned page. Facebook pixel is already there. We're good. Um, and then I publish live. As I go and publish live, this is when I change the link. This is when, this is where. Um, so as I'm publishing live, boom, get the page link change this link hit the drop down choose your page right and then customize this back in part and what i know normally do is all um um type in right there the name of the video or i'll try to like the video um um what every or every local business owner should run this ad or something like that um or or i'll just maybe title it what they see what they see right here run this ad to your local area asap I'm going to simply literally, I'm going to literally title it that. That's going to be the link. Run this. What was it again? Shit, I already forgot. Run this. Um, run this ad to your local area ASAP. Run this ad. So publish live. Run this ad to your local area ASAP. Watch this. Run this ad to your local area ASAP. So hit the pencil. Hit the drop down. Run this ad to your local area ASAP. Bam. And you only get 40 characters, but dang, that's under 40. So we're good. So look, that becomes the link. Okay. So I got the original page, which was this page right here, right? I simply cloned it. Um, and now I got this new page, which all I had to do was those basic editing. That's it. So now this is the new page, right? Run this ad to your local area ASAP. And then boom, you can notice right here in the top, in the top, the, the page title, the tab, right? Run this local ad ASAP, bam. And then you see it again in the link, run this ad to your local area ASAP, bam. Um, and, and, the, and so what I have set up is I have delay set up. I have delay set up. So on my page, in fact, let me just show you, let's close. So we just published live, right? But now what I'm gonna show you something different is when you scroll the page, anytime you see a red square, that's the block. That's the template. That's from left to right. That is the actual section of that page, right? Every page is broken down into sections from top to bottom, not left to right. It's really top to bottom. They're blocks, they're sections, however you want to call it. But as you scroll down from top to bottom and you see a red box up here, that's this section. So I can edit, which would put a background. Um, my background in this case happens to be the dark blue. That's my background, the dark blue, the dark blue, right? That's this section, the dark blue. That right there is hitting the, the pencil. 
and going into and going into background, right? Going into background image selected that happens to be a blue image, right? Um, so that's how you can change that. So if I want to save the template, I can hard it and boom, I can save that entire block right there, right? I can even clone it. Um, so that's that. And then down here, down here, and also, so again, there's the red block or the red square, the red gear. There's another one. This is this section right here. I'm saving each each little part of the section that I can save, right? Scroll down. There's another section. So the way I have mine set up, these sections below the blue background, below the video, as you can see on this page, now you see the bottom. Now you see the bottom, right? It opened up. It opened up a few minutes later. That's how I have my pages set up. So when you land here for the first time and you can you can you can you can set it for people who land here for the first time or every time the person lands here right i can delay a section of the page and so what i tend to tend, tend to like to try to do all the time is to get you to watch my video man watch the damn video for a while right once you watch the video then the bottom part then i'll distract you with all this other stuff at the bottom because that's what it is it's a distraction but in the, in this case it's a good one right we're trying to get them to schedule a call but to the consumer, it's still a distraction, right? I'm trying to watch this video and then all of a sudden I'm on your calendar, right? And then all of a sudden I'm freaking down here and I'm on your Instagram and I'm stalking you over there, right? So it's like, that's why I don't want to show all that right away, right? Right away. Because before you know it, man, you're, you're somewhere else, you know, that's just our attention span. So that's, that's another whole reason why I bring them to a page and not just straight to YouTube. Okay. So, um, that's the bottom part. So over here, as I scroll down, look, here's the first part of this bottom section. I click the red, I go to edit, I go to delay right here. And this right here is what it is. So it's simply 30 seconds. It's 30 seconds. I can, I can choose whenever on, on only on first visit on every visit, right? I can delay the section. I can, I cannot delay the section, right? Um, so I'll delay it 30 seconds bam apply and that's just what i happen to have on on all these sections now i only do this on certain pages right i don't do it on every page but on, on in this case for sure i do it on this page um and so again let's get out of here so that's that's the delay right let's get out of here we got this email to send um we're going to publish live just do it again just just for the hell of it just just publish live again and then um we got our link we did our basic editing we're good actually shit let me do that again damn it Okay, so we got our link. Let's return a dashboard and we are good. Now that we go back to pages, bam, there goes the one I cloned, right? That's it, man. That's all I do. So I have a certain category, right, for broadcast. And, and again, sometimes I'll send them to a page, sometimes in an email broadcast or maybe in an email sequence, an actual email. Sometimes I'll send them straight to YouTube. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I'll send them straight to YouTube and I don't even take them to a page. Sometimes I'll send them straight to my Facebook business page to connect with me there. Sometimes I'll send them straight to my Instagram, whatever. You can send them straight to a video on your business page. You can link anybody anywhere from an email, right? In today's video, again, all I'm doing is I'm going to, I'm going to link them to a page, which happens to be knocking out two birds with one stone. Number one, get you to watch my YouTube video because it's good for the algorithm on YouTube. And number two, to get you to schedule a call. That's why I'm taking you to a page. So let's knock out. We knocked out the page. Let's knock out this broadcast. And that's it. So my communications hover over communications, go to broadcast. And what I'm also going to do, you know what, before I even send it out as a broad, in fact, you know what, let me, let me do this real quick. Let me send this as a broadcast. Um, yeah, let me send this as a broadcast first, because that's what I wanted to show you guys to do. And then what I'm going to do um, with this video is I'm actually, again, you're getting this video, you're getting today's video from a sequence. So I'll show you how I, how I set that up as well. But let's do this broadcast first. So I'm going to hit broadcast. I'm going to go broadcast name. And it's going to be um, every business owner should run this ad, or or what did I say? Run this local ad. Let's just go run this local ad ASAP. Run this local ad ASAP. Okay. And then category, it's actually going to... Um, my clients. It's actually going to these clients right here. Um, and this is a, a real estate, um, my real estate agent clients. So 
in the YouTube video that I'm trying to get them to watch, right? I'm just simply walking them through. I'm walking a, a different client through how to set up a Facebook video ad. And so I just thought it'd be good value since it's a real estate agent that I'm helping set up one. I'm, I'm going to send this video to other real estate agents that are not quite at the level that this client is at as far as, you know, coaching. So I'm going to hope that, um, you know, I can get some coaching clients or even get some appointments out of this by showing them more value of this YouTube video. So I'm going to leave it, leave it from this email. This is the email it's coming from. Leave the name, leave the gateway. All that stays the same. You can change out this email. This could be whatever you want, but it has to be your business email, right? It has to be a business email. And to do that, come to my integrations, right click, open link in new tab. And you for sure, for sure, this should have been step one. But um, for sure, go to Kartra Mail, click on the, the, the three dots, go to edit. And all you're doing is you're putting in a business email, not a Gmail, not a Yahoo, not a Hotmail. This must be a business email. You know, your domain that you own. I get all my domains through GoDaddy. Um, and so you can set up your email through there as well. Um, there's other platforms like Google and also um, um, I think Namecheap might set up an email. Um, account, but that's what you're looking for is an actual business email. You can always send yourself a test, knock that out first. Okay. Then over here, this is that, is that business email. Okay. So I'm going to save that's, that's the email I want it to come from. Um, and I want replies to come from, come to as well. So I'm going to go there and then I'm going to go people subscribed to a list. I can hit this drop down and go with many different, different criterias, um, to send this broadcast email to, um, and in this case, it's very simple. People subscribed to a list. People subscribed to my client list. Okay, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. People subscribe to that list, and there's and or right. This is very very specific. And I'm going with the and. I'm not gonna go with the or. I'm gonna go with the and. And does not have tag. Client, FB ad, coaching client. Okay, that's next level. Okay. So this right here, they're subscribed to this list, but they're not a, a full-blown coaching client just yet. Um, and, and subscribe, or I'm going to, I'm going to put, or, or now we're going to, or, or they're subscribed. It's not, and right. It's, or, or they're subscribed to book completed five steps. Okay. Or they're, they're subscribed to that one. Okay. Um, completed five steps that that should have been way more than 86. Let's subscribe to let's take that one out or subscribe to list. Let's go with um, subscribe to list. Um, completed five steps. Hmm, interesting that that should have been more way more way 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 more but I'll go through that later. And then, and then we'll go or subscribed to, let's go with, um, 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 book customers. Yeah. For some reason, this is not updating, but hopefully the system catches it. Hopefully the system catches it and, and actually adds the ones that are on this list. For some reason, these ones are not populating for whatever reason, but I'm going to, I'm going to keep it pushing. I'm going to keep it pushing and we're going to go single email. I'm going to go advanced. That's where you can come in here and look at different templates, full templates for all these different Kartra templates. I can click, drag it over and work out of that template, or I can just save a template, right? I already have one saved. So I just go off of that one. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply just edit the email. So I'm going to hit the pink pencil. I'm going to come in here. I'm going to write out this email. I'm going to keep this. I'm going to keep this, the, the bottom part, right? My, my basic signature. I'm going to change out this image. I want this image to be the same image of today's video of the YouTube video of the thumbnail, right? It was actually released yesterday on YouTube, but you know what I'm saying? So that thumbnail, that's the thumb, thumbnail that I used for the, for the YouTube, for my YouTube video. I'm going to use that same one for the email. I'm going to use that same one because as they, as they click, so here's where I'm taking them. I'm taking them to this page right here. Bam. That's where I'm linking them, linking them to you guys. That's what it's all about. So if they click on the image, they're going to go straight to that page. Okay. Now I still need that link because I got some stuff to write. I'm going to go, Hey, 
and I'm going to go first name. I always go with dynamic variable, copy, and put in control V, put in their first name. I always, oh, damn it. I always call them by their first name. Let me do that again. So control V, there's that. I make sure it's the same font, right? So there's that. Hey, Jack, I'm going to go hope all is well. There is the email, you guys. There is the simple email. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hyperlink. I hyperlink the image, right? Now, let me come back in here to the image, get the actual. Okay, I just edited the words just a bit, but let's just go ahead and link everything. So get this, copy this right here, and then boom. All I'm going to do is I'm going to simply come through my 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 email, right, the, the verbiage, and I'm going to simply see what I can hyperlink. And so this is how I do it. Um, first of all, the title is going to be did you, and this is what you want to be doing as well. You want to be practicing this. And, and also look at some of the emails that you get, right? I'm sure a lot of you guys get junk email. Like I get email in my spam. Sometimes I actually go and look at it all. Like I want to see what headline, only because this, this is the marketer in me, right? I want to see what headlines catch my attention, right? In my email, random people emailing me, like what catches my attention? When I capture leads through, through these funnels, I keep it real. Like me, I am who I am. A lot of you guys found me from YouTube. A lot of you guys found me from Facebook. I am who I am. That's who you need to, you need to be. Don't try to change it up. Don't try to put out video and be someone else. Like be you. Um, because as you go and start to write these emails, you want it to sound like you as well, right? You don't want it to sound, you don't want, that's why I'm not, I don't believe in, in a, a copywriter to write these emails for you because it's not you. You need these to come out like, like it's you and you want to put them together. Like you're, like you're talking to a friend. That's how a lot of my emails come, come across is where it's my personality. So there I'm talking to a friend. So for example, in the subject line, I'm going to simply put, and whatever I put in the subject line, I also put in the body of the email. That's a psychological hack as well. So in the, in the subject line is going to be, did you see this video yesterday? Did you see this video yesterday? When you get that in your inbox, you're like, what, what video, right? That's normally what a person would think. That's what I would think shit, right? So that so little catchy headlines like that um, are are good. Not too hypey because it could it could get sent to spam. So you want to just kind of keep it keep it keep it somewhat clean and 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 just you know catchy. So that's going to be the subject line. That's also in the email. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bold anything I hyperlink. I end up bolding. Sometimes I I won't hyperlink a bold, but but when I do hyperlink for sure, I bold and I change the color to blue. And it's this third down the third blue down. Change that color and then boom, highlight it, highlight it again. And now I'm going to add the link. This is the link to the page. Okay. So I'm going to scroll down just a bit. Let me um, scroll down just a bit. Okay. So let's do this again. We're going to hyperlink it, paste in the page, right? That is the page that I'm trying to drive them to. That's that link right there. I'm going to link it there. And I'm also going to link it down here. Watch here. So let's bold that. Let's bold the watch here. Let's change the color to blue. Let's do it again and hyperlink it. Okay, perfect. So boom, that's that's pretty much enough, right? I hyperlinked. Um, did you see this video yesterday? Um, I'm showing my friend Rebecca how to set up. Okay. This, this is a simple and fun video in which you do not need a fancy. And I'm going to simply bold that and simply upper uh, underline it. That's it. Do not, right. I'm not hyperlinking it. I'm just, I'm going to just bold it. That's fine. Um, let's call an intro video. I could, I could hyperlink even, even that, right. Let's just do it for the hell of it. You don't want to put too many hyperlinks in. Um, we'll bold, we'll change the color to blue, we'll link. That's about the max, right? I got, I got one, two, three, four things on the, on the email hyperlinked. That's all you need. That's, that's the most, right? So that's it. So boom, subject line, email, everything's hyperlinked. I come down here, save and next. And what I'm going to do, no automation needed, save and next. I can schedule either now, later, or save as draft. I'm going to simply send it now. Right now, it's it's 1.20 p.m. my time. 
boom, that's going to be sent now. Save and next, yes, and that is it. So I did update, you know, the the contacts. I know when we were looking at it prior, it was a, it wasn't populating the list or whatever, but now it did. So that's going out to 175 very active and engaging um, leads that I have. All of those, in fact, are, are actually not all of them. A lot of them are are, are, are are clients, but they're not coaching clients. And that's where that, that email is going to. So that's a broadcast email, you guys. And right away, right away, I can go to analytics. I can go to broadcast. This is all tracked in real time. So that's what's so powerful about Kartra is that I can come over here to the broadcast and I can search all categories or I can go to the one category that I sent the broadcast to which happen to be um, clients. It happened to be in that in that category. I can go all broadcast or I can go um, um, the name of that broadcast, which happened to be, um, shit, what was the name? I think the name was run this local ad ASAP. I think that was the name, right? Or I could just freaking go all broadcast. It doesn't even matter because I can search it by the day. I can go just today, right? Just today, just today. I just sent that one broadcast, you know? So it's like, damn, I can just search just for today. Boom, five already opened. Five already opened, one already clicked. Look at that. This is real time, you guys. So I can come over here, check the email, right? I Sometimes I'll send a test email to myself, but but I've done this a million times. And so that email was good to go. So yeah, man, it shows everything in real time. It shows who opened it. I can click on the five and, and it'll give me a, a list of everyone who's actually opened it, right? So that's really, really cool. These these leads have have opened have opened that that email. And boom, here's the email. I click on the the, the name of it. Um, and so did you see this video yesterday? And boom. Hey Jack, hope hope you're well in closing deals. Did you see this video yesterday? And boom, that's where everything goes. And then when they click, boom, they come straight to that one page. That's how I'm going to broadcast email, you guys. What I'm also going to do is take this training that I'm doing for you guys, Carter Affiliates, and I'm going to put it in the sequence, okay? So um, here's how I do that. I might as well just show you how to do it real quick. So let's close this part out. This is the, um, this is the analytics. Let's go to my communications, and we want to go to sequences. So look. The way you guys are getting this video today, this email today, okay, is because you're somewhere in my email sequence and you're somewhere in the Kartra affiliate email sequence. I come in here, I click on edit, and all I'm going to do is simply add an email to this sequence, okay, and it's going to be this email right here how to send a broadcast email. That's the name of this email you guys are going to be getting. How to send a broadcast email. So I have I have this one. Hi, Stacy. Here's a wealth of knowledge. Are you on Facebook? These are all emails that you guys already got. Okay. Now you're about to get this one. So what I do is I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to space the complete. So I'm going to simply take the line, hover over the line, X out of the line. I'm going to hover over, click, hover over this right here until I see a cross. I'm going to click hold the click, drag it down. I'm going to give myself some space. I'm going to come up here to the top left, click and drag it over, hold the click, let go. And boom, this email is going to go next. So this is going three days later. I'll send this one out three days later as well. So wait number of days from the previous email. Um, I can, I can wait as, as long as I want. I can send it immediately after the previous email, whatever. So this one's going to go out. I'll, I'll just send it, keep it the same three days, three days. Okay. So we'll hit next. Time, days, I leave all that the same. Communication, um, this is going to be um, how to send a broadcast email. Bam. How to send a broadcast email. Next. It's going to come from, it's actually going to come from David at um, profitwithkartra.online. So as you guys get this email, as you guys get this email, Look at where it's coming from. It's coming from, yeah, from me, David Cantero, center name, but check the email where it's coming from. It's coming from this email, right? I have this email set up through GoDaddy um, forwarding, email forwarding. I, I own the .com, profitwithcartridge.online, right? Um, when people go there, it's simply my affiliate link. It's linked to my affiliate link with Kartra. So that 
that dot line online, that link, profit with Kartra dot online. That's what you see in the description of all my YouTube videos, right? Because I'm trying to get Kartra affiliates. That's where you guys come in. That's why I'm trying to bring as much value to you guys. So you guys succeed with this platform and we all make money, right? So um, this happens to be a, a dot, a domain that I own. And, and that is the email that I set up. So it's going to come from there. Hit next. And then I'm going to send if, I'm going to send if they're still subscribed to the list. So in this case, if you guys, you guys are getting it, if you guys are still subscribed to Kartra Affiliates or, or, or you're still subscribed to my sequence, subscribe to sequence, which happens to be, happens to be the same name. I name everything the same, the list and the sequence, same name, Kartra Affiliates, right? You got your list on one hand and then you have your sequences on the other. You guys are getting this video because you're in this sequence. So if you're still subscribed, these are the these are the recipients. These are the rules, right? If you're still subscribed to either one of these, the list or the or the sequence, then you'll get this email. Okay, so that's the setup. Next, single email. Next, and this is the simple email. So that's why you always want to create a template because as I come in here, I click advanced, I go design templates. I look at my templates, my templates, and boom, I'm just going off the same template. And all I'm doing is simply um, um, editing this top part, and that's it. So now this right here, this right here, it's going to you guys. This is a freaking email that you just got done right. You just got done reading, right? And so, and so, and so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply, um, I'm going to simply link this out. I got to link this out, so that's why I'm going to go back to my to my pages so i have these two tabs open so so important i'm going to go back to my pages right let's see if i have i have Kartra affiliates yes i already have these page actually i already have these pages in here but 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 what i'm going to do is i'm going to go to i'm going to go to broadcast and i'll just simply i'll just simply you know what i'm going to link this out you guys to to a YouTube video. So you guys are going to get are going to are going to simply just get just get linked out to a YouTube video without even being on a page. That's what I'm going to do here. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to say hey hey first name, there goes that. Again, always using I'm always using their first name. Hope you're well. Hope you're well. Again, same damn line. Hope you're well. And business is booming. Here's a here's a tutorial video on how I set how I send broadcast broadcast emails through. Kartra. I hope you get value out of this one. Watch here. Okay. So here's what I'm going to do, you guys. I am going to come back to this one because I need to upload this video. This video that I'm recording for you right here, right now in real time, I obviously have to upload. And I'm what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload it to YouTube. I'm going to upload it to YouTube. I'm going to simply go to YouTube, go to that video, and I'm going to simply get the get the share link, and that's what's going to go over here. That's it. That's it. So I'm not going to even bother making a page at all for you guys. I'm going to just simply link you out to to a to a YouTube video. That's all I'm going to do. So I'm going to, I'm going to link it there. I'll link it in in the image down here. So what I'll do is I'll just put um I'll put a different image here. And in fact, you know what? I won't even put an image there. I won't even put an image there. I'll, de I'll delete that part. Um, I'll just leave chat soon. And, and that's it. I'll come back here. I'll upload this video. And um, how, how, how I send broad and we'll go broadcast emails how I send broadcast emails. Okay, so hope you're well and business is booming. Here's a tutorial video. I, and what I'll do is I'll even bold this part. Let's bold that. Let's turn that to blue. 
and we're going to link that. Here's a tutorial video on how I send broadcast broadcast emails through Kartra. I hope you get value out of this one. Watch here. Perfect. And that's all I'm going to do, you guys. So um, I'm going to hit next. I'm going to hit next. And here's the last part. I'm going to hit next. I'm going to hit create. No automation needed. It's going to bring me back over here. It's going to say inactive. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply hover over the dots and I'm going to activate. Then I'm going to grab this half circle right here at the top, this, this gray half circle. I'm going to see the cross. I need the cross. I need the cross. I'm going to hover over until I see a cross. And then I'm going to simply drag the line, the arrow, and connect it. That's it. Then what I can do is I can drag this bottom one and connect it to the complete. Now, I put a complete at the very, very end, so it could, it could be tracked, right? People, the system will know who completed and who's been through every email. Um, or I can leave it open-ended. I don't have to put a complete because my whole thing is I just add more every week. I could for sure do that too um, and not add a complete. But I'll just add a complete. Then I'll come over here and arrange it, line it up, and that, and that email will go out to you guys. So to you guys that are on, on, on Kartra, bless you guys. If you need anything, man, reach out. Um, comment on any of my YouTube videos and, and, and let me know how I can support you, how I can really help you. Um, let me know what questions you have. You know, you can always reply to this email. You can reply to this email. Let me know, say, Hey, David, make a video on, on, on setting up a calendar or make a video, setting up a landing page. Let me know what you guys need help with. And I'll, I'll make videos for you and, and hopefully, you know, bring some value. So I'm done with that one. That's the email we just added, how to send a broadcast email. Um, I'm going to hit done and exit. And now, boom, that email is, is in rotation and will go to that lead or that Kartra affiliate, which happens to be you guys um, when the time is right. So that's how you do the damn thing, you guys. I hope you guys got value from that video and I'll see you on the next one. Over and out.